Hello there. Hey there. Hi, Hi Ted. Howdy. Hey Ted. Good luck this weekend. Have a cool banquet. Right. Hey, Miss Barnaby. Oh, where are shoes? Ted, if it's not right, it is not. Okay, oh, okay. Madam. More than that. Hey, I don't. She always being so sad. Mm hmm. Is that his mom? What to say? Uh -huh. <laughs> That's crazy. First of all, don't that do that. That's crazy. Like, when was the last time we talked to you, mom? Right. Just, I mean, I'm glad that he speak to people because he would have, if it was me, I wouldn't see the lady. Walk right past mm -hmm. her. What you mean my mom was on the bench? Never. Mm -mm. She was in America. She wouldn't call my name up because don't because don't nobody call me over Also, here. that's weird. I'm not responding to that. <laughs> oh, wow. Hello. We're not open for another half hour. Would you care to wait not here? <laughs> <laughs> no. Wait? We're actually here to speak with Nathan Shelley? He works here, yeah? No such man exists. <laughs> he just living his best life. No such man exists. I just like working here. I like spending time with my girlfriend. Oh, uh, no. where'd she go? She was right there. <laughs> oh, that was my girlfriend. Mm -hmm. she... This is uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Never. No, so what, Ted? Ask you guys to come here. To get Never. Oh, I know Ted doesn't know about it. Huh? <laughs> you can't come back. You just actually wanted to come back before we approached Ted. Okay. Well, sorry guys. I just don't think it's a good idea for me to come back to Richmond. So, thank you. Well. Yeah, that's the conversation you and him need to have. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, everything's fine. I just always want to see England, so I booked this trip as a little Mother's Day gift to myself. Uh -uh. I mean, how long you been here? Just a week. A week? What? Where the heck you staying? Girl! An adorable little hostel. A hostel? They are backpacking through Europe. So much sex. Mom! No, it's not me. The Australians. No, I get it. Okay. Uh, well, look, how about you just, just stay here clear. for this trip, all right? Only if I'm not a hassle. You're not a hassle, Mom. Okay, please stay here. Okay. Okay, good. All right. Now, look, I got to get to work. These parents, they be losing their mind. Jamie, on the hills of making your England debut, how does it feel to be named Premier League Player of the Month? Yeah, it feels good, I guess, but it's um, it's really the, the team making me look good, so I should be doing a better job of making them look good. Right? You are right? Whoa. So, yeah, makes me makes me feel bad. Oh, <gasps> okay. Uh, he also scored a goal. That, 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 that was meant to be a pass. I shouldn't count that. Jamie. Jamie. A goal is a lie. Maybe he's scared. The goal is a lie. <laughs> Maybe he's scared to be like the like how he was before. Maybe. And so he's like, no, 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 it's not yeah. me. It's not me. It's the team. Right. Jamie. He's well, also, you do stuff. I apologize, especially oh. to the kids. <laughs> this is Lasso. I just wanted to introduce myself. I'm Trent Quinn. Oh, hello, Trent. Oh, hello. I was wondering if I could uh, uh, just have a little chat with you. About Trent, your hair is fabulous. Yes. Are you just styling? No. Uh, I'm Listen. Yeah, I do, man. Or else I die. Oh, damn. Oh, <laughs> like, hi. This is not a week for your Mr. Fucking Humble Great Teammate bullshit. Right. We got to see you on Saturday. So we I can't cry. It's brick. You What's going on today? Did you do that, you know, Oh! Fucking dying or some shit. No, no, I'm no, I'm just, I'm just tired. Oh, oh. exhaustion. Sleep and I can't eat. Why? And I wash me out, but I don't use any conditioner anymore because I'm working too. Like, what's the fucking point? Oh, what? The guy in the Red Bull commercial who's, who's pushing that big rock up the hill, but but he's lost his wings, Roy. I feel like, I feel like I've lost my wings. Oh no. Aww. Imposter syndrome. Where the fuck are my wings, Roy? Yeah. Oh, oh wait now. Oh wait now. No. <laughs> Jamie, you almost had me. <laughs> Don't do that. Uh, <laughs> Don't suck with that. Go. You have a real hug. Go Get suck out. Away. Get out. Yeah. Get out. It's the good one. <laughs> it's a damn it. That baby sad. Hey Roy, would it bother you if we brought Nate back? No, I don't give a fuck. He's 
she's great at the shit I suck at. But there you go. I'll grab you something. Okay. Everything all right? Yeah. I just come down with a case of none of your fucking business. Oh. Oh. Like, it don't have. Okay. Right. Nick, come. If you bring that Judas back, I will burn this place to the fucking ground. I'm, 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 I'm with you, Carlos. I'm with you, Carlos. <laughs> Is it true that you got on stage and danced with Bruce Springsteen? No, that was Courtney Cox. What I did do was sing Glory Days with the Bruce Springsteen. Mama just lying! <laughs> it was the bar mitzvah, that's right. It was the bar mitzvah. That's the only difference. Is she have some kind of like memory problem? Or is she just all stretching just the truth? She's just a mama and she too overly proud. Beardo. Lottie daddy. Lottie daddy. Beardo, beardo. Beardo, beardo. Piss! Why mama can't have fun? Is she still in your thunder? What's going on? There's something so sad about a suitcase. You just need to cry. Mean, it's like... It's like a drawer without a home. Oh, shit. Oh. Uh, it's happening. Jamie, look at me. You got a lot going on right now. Mm, there's a lot going. Maybe do the therapist bad. Hey, why they bring that black lady off? Hate you. Uh, that's when the person who's going to be booing the loudest in the crowd is your dad. Oh, I think a lot, yeah. And I know a lot of people are shit talking your hair online. They're what? Yes. They're what? Think about it. if you guys. <laughs> we'll be on the precipice of achieving everything that you have dreamed. Oh my god. <laughs> he is overwhelmed, mm -hmm. Keely. Did not help. So he is tired. Jesus. How'd I go with Jamie? Yeah, I fucked it. Made it. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Roy and Keely. Yes. Next to each other like before. Yeah. We just seem to get first friends. Yeah, and she just looks very nice. Shh. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> exactly. The romance, you see it. Y'all are sad. Don't cry. Sure, girl. girl. <laughs> Don't cry. We're Brinkley. I wanted it to be you. I wanted it to be you so bad. Right here, yes. Let's see. Let it out. I'm Keely, honestly. Where's your heart? Not in this movie. Clearly. Since Seattle's still a far superior film. I agree. No, no, I'm just saying. <laughs> You don't feel the people behind you are right. having a big ass pink coat. You know they click clocking. We're just walking. Uh -huh. <laughs> Keely. <laughs> I'm sick of her. I like he knows y'all behind <clears throat> you. You got to. Why are you following me? Just want to make sure you're okay, you prick. What's going on, Jamie? Right. Come on. No, I need a yes or no for that question. First. Oh, God, I'm not going to know. Uh... Where are you taking me? Are you Jamie Tuck? Yeah. Well, like Jamie Fuck. Screw you, dickhead. Bridge. Yeah, who are you? See, you're going to fuck you up tomorrow. Yeah, you fuck. fuck. These badass kids. Good lads. <laughs> <laughs> Not that was good. Jamie. How you doing, Simon? Uh, this is Keeler. That's Roy. Come on in, come on in. What was that? Is this brother's name? Is my little boyfriend? Oh, hello. Greg. Uh, I don't remember. Georgie, we got visitors. I don't remember his backstory. I just know his daddy and shit. Right. So it must be his mama. Mm -hmm. Hello, Sister. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm how old are we supposed to believe Jamie is? 22? Yeah. Oh, so lovely to finally meet you both. I come and give you a hug, but I'm not letting go of this one. Oh. 
Oh, there they go. Right, who wants some sweet treats? You, you feel the way? Why are you saying it? Love it! Oh, oh. you feel He just knows. <laughs> a shrine? Yes. That's a one and only. Uh, whoa. Oh! Ah. <laughs> yeah. New poachers have come and gone over the years. Henri, Gerard, Ronaldo. But never that. Roy Kent always remains. Always. Oh. You his hero. Is it done? Excuse me. sure that you're just okay with that i would be bothered and you are amazing you are oh let your mama being proud of you motivates you when you come on for england shut up go nope that's it it's great to meet you one for the ride. This way, babe. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love you. <laughs> I was trying to bring it in. <laughs> we a family. Look at me experience love. I'm he saying. get it. Seriously. <laughs> Call your mama. What she doing? What she yeah. at? He told you to come. You don't send the car pick her up. Breathe. Breathe. Mm, the ringing. Mm -hmm. oh. Why your mama make you anxious? <laughs> oh, we did. Uh, when Freddie Mercury briefly owned the team in 1980, he tried to make the Fat Bottom Girls the team and. Mm. Work out. Did a bunch of people get offended? Just the flat bottom girl. <laughs> My father went to art school with Freddie Mercury. What? He's lying. Everyone always talks about his amazing four octave vocal range, but my father always insisted that if you actually asked Freddie what his greatest talent was, he would have said flipping straight. <gasps> Damn! Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. Wow. Do I need to watch that movie? <laughs> Is that the part of the documentary? <laughs> the biopic? Like immediately booing as soon as you touch the ball. Wait, I'm not looking at things. What's wrong with you? Are you going to see what you're doing? I'll celebrate when the final whistle is blown. Oh. I'll do the move and jinx it. <laughs> Richmond are not listening. Oh, what? oh a sliver of space for David Arnold. Is this the equalizer? Yes! Right, what do you mean they're not listening? Yes! Dan Dan is not letting this go through. He's been good today. Oh, I want to call Slash Burple and I feel racism. <laughs> <laughs> Takes the corner. Van Dam races off his line to punch, but he oh. finds Elakobi. She was going to report me to the. Oh. I can't say you because then you know what I've done. Yeah. <clears throat> My hands are tied. She's pushing you. She says, I'm trying to see. You're supposed to quit when we have to talk. Then damn is honest, man. man. Come on. It's halftime. 
brick wall in front of the goal. No, Arlo, that's a person. I can see his arms and legs. Chris. <laughs> Chris. Personally, I'm fine with him playing her. I played her all the time. You can't walk upstairs. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you shut up, Roy Kent. <laughs> and you have to put him out there like that, coach. <laughs> You know, Jamie is hating the pops, ain't motivating like it used to. It might be time to try something different. Mm -hmm. He's forgiven. Mm. Mm. I fucked I ain't giving him nothing. Mm -mm. No, you ain't giving him anything. It's for yourself. If you choose to do that, you're giving that to yourself. Ted, are you listening to the words that you mm -hmm. say? Because I feel like some forgiveness needs to happen on your end, too, now. Mm -hmm. I'm like, yeah! I'm like, oh! That's it, y'all. That's it. You like him. Maybe I gotta help now. I'm right. saying. Don't get a point. Damn. Oh, what ankle? Gotcha. What ankle? <laughs> <laughs> you tried. Oh, he's like, boy, go. No. I got this. Where we at? Number two? Hey! Yeah. And Richmond with a late substitution. Yeah, mm -hmm. no rest. Mm -hmm. We wanted to give you a shot. You did what you needed mm -hmm. to do. Uh -huh. Have a seat. Rest up now. Because we can't walk upstairs. <laughs> right. To so this response from the mm -hmm. city supporters. And he gonna cry. Was also one of oh, look at you. Don't For real. That's why people get on my nerves. Y'all don't even know what you like and don't mm -hmm. like. He's a tough kid. His dad would have been proud. Uh, yeah, I was like, that His dad would have been proud. His dad dead. Oh, no. His dad That's dead, so y'all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Is that oh, I don't remember what his daddy looked like. I don't either, but I'm guessing I'm going to assume yes. Uh, no, no, I know you've already seen it. I just don't know if you watched the whole thing. Look, look, look. Oh yeah, coach ain't never forget. Nate had to hide under my desk here for like three whole hours while we were all hooping and hollering and celebrating all around him. <laughs> <laughs> Once we all split, he thought he was in the clear. And boom, cleaning crew shows up. Uh, <laughs> That's another two hours. Oh my gosh. Yeah. They don't clean the dish. Show us who he is. Well, after they leave, he crawls out. His legs just gotta be jelly. Barely stand up. Look at this. He goes to check the doors. Locked in. Oh, locked. <laughs> oh man, that's not a gun. Had to climb out the window here just to get out of the building. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. You know, I don't know about you, coach, but I hope that either all of us or none of us are judged by the actions of our weakest moments. Mm -hmm. But rather about the strength we show when and if mm. we're ever given a second chance. Damn, oh, you preaching now, Ted. You preaching now. Because I sure was looking at that from a different perspective. Mm -hmm. I'm like, look at this fool. Mm -hmm. each other. Oh. You better say it. Coach said, y'all supposed to be healing this season, mm -hmm. not me. Mm -hmm. I'm okay. Currently running 10 apology letter. It's 60 Damn. pages, but I'm just looking for a few truths. Damn, you sound like Alexander Hamilton. Hmm. <laughs> Got a lot to say. pamphlet, okay? A lot to apologize for. Some shit that he didn't even know about. Oh, God. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. A nightmare. I love this. So listen, I got to get to karaoke, mm. but let me get this off. Yeah, kill me. Yep. Yes. <laughs> and I would have gone straight back to prison if Ted didn't come down there and convince those cops that he gave me the car. Mm. Just like in Les Mis. Her story is very similar to Les Mis. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, for stealing a loaf of meth. A loaf of meth? Huh. Thank you. Oh, the tear. He didn't want to remember where he came anything? from. I think it might make us feel better. <laughs> Wait a minute. 
You gonna do it for real? <laughs> You're not gonna do it for real. You're not doing it. Just gonna touch heads. Yeah, just gent gentle. I see. Monday. Dang. Hurt Ted again. It's your ass. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you. Cooking dinner, both of them. No, oh, you're welcome. And fuck you for not wanting to talk. Oh! Your mama. Thank you for flying all the way here to come see me. And not talk. And fuck you for not telling me you were coming. Yeah. Get it out. Thank you for all this. And fuck you for not working on yourself. It's bold. For seeking help after we lost dad. Mm. And for not talking to me about it either. Mm. Just glossing over the whole thing and, and acting like everything was all right. Because he don't know how to process stuff now. Yeah. He can't deal. I didn't know what to do, Ted. So I pretended I was OK. OK. Well, thank you for the apology. And fuck you for making me think I had to pretend to. Mm. Mm. Right, I, I appreciate it, but you need to stop that. Sharing all this. You're in my house. I'm grown. Mm -hmm. I got to get you off. You ain't at that grown. So long. Yeah, OK. So fuck you, too. And, um, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> you're right, Ted. I do have something to say to you. Fuck you. Fuck you for not calling me when you need help. Your son misses you. Uh-huh. He know that. Mm -hmm. He know that. Mm -hmm. I miss him, too. You've had oh, to quit yeah. and see him go home. Yeah. That's the end of the season of the show. Mm-hmm. He was running from Michelle. That's really it. He got to go back to deal with that. Thank you. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> it's only fair. Oh, right. You ain't going to say fuck you five times to me and I don't think what it is. No. Uh, she baked break some bread and did Right? Mm -hmm. Why do people keep doing stuff like this? We just this had a conversation. Not, okay. Do you know what time it is? Uh, 9.30. Uh, or half nine, as you folks say over here for some goofy ass reason. <laughs> now, this is that time of year when I come down here and reveal something to you. Yeah. Oh, snap. It's that time of the season. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, okay. Here we go. I've got nothing. Oh. Oh, I really tried as well. I mean, even on the walk over here, I was thinking something would pop into my head, but no, nope. absolutely nothing. You got some? Okay. Well, that's okay. <laughs> I got one. What's going on? Mm -hmm. yeah. We already we know. know. Mm -hmm. this, I'm, I'm gone after this game. The song. When I think of home, I think mm -hmm. of the world. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He going to the house. Yes. Okay, so I don't really, I don't know if I really have much. I'm glad that Jamie, like, overcame the stuff that he was going through with his father and mm -hmm. stuff like that. Yes. It seems like once his dad completes whatever that treatment is, they can work on reconciliation. Yeah. Perhaps. Maybe. I don't know. Um, Sam and Rebecca keep giving each other the eye. I, know. I don't want it. It she was cute, to... but she has to back to Amsterdam. That was good for her. I want her to have that man. I feel like it was, and maybe, you know, sometimes... In life and in movies, you just run into that person and they're just like, they're there for that moment in that, mm -hmm. that time. That's what you needed yeah. to help you realize something about yourself, mm -hmm. but it wasn't meant to be something mm -hmm. substantial. Mm -hmm. Right. So that could be what that was. Yes, maybe. And I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> Even though it could be true, I hate that that's uh -huh. it. Mm -hmm. They seem like just pure chemistry and, and like mm -hmm. an instant yeah. connection. Right. So why not let us explore that? But I can see it would be really complicated for her because she would have to move there because I don't see him moving to her. I don't see any one of them really making a move. That's true. So. But she's the owner of a whole club. I don't see her giving that up either. That's right. what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, I don't, mm -hmm. like she feels it's necessary for her to be there for the day to day. Mm -hmm. And you can't do that in Amsterdam. Right. So. Mm -hmm. And he seemed, like you said, very settled into whatever his life is there. Mm -hmm. um, he has a kid. Right? He has a kid. Mm -hmm. So. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. It was cute. Yeah. Maybe she can have babies with Sam. I don't know. Yes, we still have to get to that last prophecy. I don't know. What I was like... the rest of it? Oh, it was just I... that she'll be a mother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't remember Everything else more. happened, yeah. I want to see if him and his, uh, if Sam and his, uh, his chef will be more. I, I kind of liked that for him. They, have a cute they are cute together. Mm -hmm. She keep it real. Mm -hmm. And he's polite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She helps him be more of like a 
you it's okay to talk shit sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Encourage that. Mm-hmm. Um Yeah, I kinda wanted that to be a thing, but yeah. I don't know if they're gonna get us that. Right. So I'm not mad either way. Mm-mm. I mean like yay for Nate and Coach. I'm glad that we finally got some backstory on Coach Beard because I don't know if we ever knew anything about him Mm-mm. besides that he just be a little violent <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and he's a little strange. Uh-huh. But now we know why. Like yeah. mm-hmm. he had a troubled past, so mm-hmm. that's just his personality. Mm-hmm. Um, they really try in this episode to hit you with the emotions. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Jamie, Coach Nate, Ted and his mom, everybody, the whole yeah. ending. Mm-hmm. Like, if I had maybe a rougher week, they would have got me. <laughs> but I also, like, I've been watching Titanic. I've been watching, like, sad movies all week. So, I'm like, my I've been gosh. getting my emotions out. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> this is nothing. I've been uh, watching people die, okay? I am determined. <laughs> Hold on. I don't know. One of y'all gonna break. This next one, might get me. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna we'll lie. See. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Mm-hmm. We'll see. Mm-hmm. Well, that's all I got. Yes. Yeah, all right, y'all. That was episode eleven. Ted Lasso. We are at the end. We are at the. End. <laughs> we are at the end. <laughs> y'all, drop down in the comments what you thought about this episode. Um, what was your favorite like heartstring pull moment? Was it Coach Beard and Nate? Was it Ted and his mama? What was it? Drop that in the comments, and we'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye. Bye.